hi children so today we are going to talk about the element of art that is pattern a pattern is a design in which lines shape forms or colors are repeated okay just like this the part that is repeated is called motif pattern can be regular or irregular art pattern as a visual element of art the visual element of pattern is constructed by repeating or echoing the element of an artwork to communicate a sense of balance and harmony contrast rhythm and movement for example here like this okay there are two basic types of pattern in art one is natural pattern and man made pattern natural pattern means pattern in nature are visible regularities of form found in a natural world natural pattern includes symmetries trees spirals waves cracks meanders forms tessellations and stripes are important because they offer visual clues to an underlying order and man made patterns are often used in design and can be abstract such as those in mathematics science and language in art pattern can be used to create a visual effects on the observer so grab your all art material and let's start so today we are going to create some patterns and we are practicing on that so let's start our class you can see i have drawn some squares and rectangles on this paper to practice first i have made the border see now i will make the squares with the marker now i have made some uh, squares rectangles to draw my pattern so uh, my base is ready you can use any medium you can use pencil color watercolor crayons anything so with any medium you can fill this squares or rectangles with different pattern like this you can fill your whole square see like this i filled this square with the circles now i am moving to the next uh, in this rectangle i am making some zigzag lines like this like this zigzag line just a random zigzag lines so you can fill this whole rectangle okay i'm done with this or wait like this okay now i'm moving to the third rectangle here i'm making some spirals like this just the random spirals i will you just fill your uh, rectangle with this spiral i'm just filling this square or rectangle like this only i'm just filling this rectangle like this type of circles in a line i am drawing a circle like this huh? i filled this with the circle i'm just making this uh, smaller circle the darker one with black color only okay if you have sketch pen you can use with colorful sketch pen but i don't have sketch pen so i'm using this with the black marker and then after that i'm i will going to fill this color so if you have uh, colorful sketch pens with you you can draw all these pattern with your colorful sketch pen okay in that rectangle i'm just making some flowers like this so i'm just filling this square with this pattern i'm done with, with this square now i'm moving to the next square in that i'm making some spiral lines like this or just you can do uh, you can say i'm just scribbling this just the scribble i'm just filling this with some overlapping lines i fill this like this okay now i'm moving to the next rectangle here i'm making some different pattern 
just at um, the corner I am making one big flower like this. some circle in that. In this rectangle, I am making some hearts like this. It's very easy. So, I am filling all these with the hearts. So, I am done with this. Now, I am moving to the next rectangle and here I am making something. Hmm, see, in that I am just making the big circles like this and, and filling the circles with the lines like this I am done with this uh, now I am moving to the next square here I am making something different with the lines ok so see what I am doing I am just drawing like random lines in the pair of three like this I have filled my square now I am moving to the next square and here I am again using the lines to fill this square just uh, I am just first fill this fill the lines like this so now I am filling this with black one line here and then the zigzag line leave this then I am just filling the pattern making the pattern like this leave this line make some dots like this here I am just filling this You can do according to you and then leave this in that again I am drawing some circles and I am filling this small triangle. Here again see my pattern is done. Okay in this rectangle I am just making the polka dots just like this. I'm just filling this with the dots only random dots anywhere in the rectangle so I am done with this now I am moving to the next rectangle or square whatever here I am just making some wavy lines like this ok so I am done with this now I am moving towards next here I am just uh, making again I am making just one flower but in a different manner ok so I am done with this here I am just making this random squares like this I fill this square with a random square like this. I am moving to the next rectangle. Here I am just making this kind of pattern and after that I am just the same. Just the same. And I am just filling this or like this. I am just drawing the lines in that with the gap like this I have drawn the lines in this gap and I am just filling these lines with black color like this so I am done with this rectangle now I am moving to the next rectangle here I am just making one 
big heart like this and in I'm just making it bold like this and filling these lines after filling this I'm just making some dots in that heart filling it with the dots like this so just with the dots I'm done with my heart so in this rectangle I'm just making random triangles and I'm going to fill this rectangle with the triangles this is just the random triangles I'm done with this rectangle now I'm moving to the next rectangle here I'm doing something see what I'm doing in this rectangle I'm just making the leaves the pattern of leaves like this I am filling it like this okay like this huh so I'm done with this now in this rectangle I'm just making the square spiral squares like this just like this so like this I fill this I'm done with this now I'm moving to the next rectangle in that I'm just making uh, just some circles The random circles filling this circles with the lines this and then making the another line like this square pattern you make and I'm filling it with the dots like this I'm done with this nice now nah? Now in this next I am making some oval shapes like this I am done with that now the next I am just filling it with the dotted lines these wavy lines this zigzag filling it leave and then again this. so I'm done with that in that I'm just randomly moving and then after that I'm just making some abstract figure like this in that and filling it dark like this just making one more line so I'm done with that okay now in this square I'm just one two three four lines like this one two three four lines then again one two three four see like this I'm filling one two three four lines then again from here one two three four lines then one two three four like this I will fill this rectangle so like this I fill one two three four <sighs> finally I have completed this now moving towards next square I am just making some like this some Rest I will fill with the dots. So I am done with this pattern. I will make some flowers like this. The three flowers like this. Like this. Making one dot. These are my favorite. 
I like these flowers very much. And then making some lines to make grass. This. And from this side also. Here also I will make some lines like this. So, I will make one, one flower here also. So finally I am done with my all the boxes. You can see. So, to fill this pattern, I am using these pencil color. I have all the shades. So, it's up to you. Whatever the color you want to choose, you can choose. So let's start the color. So I am making this with red color. Uh, what we will do, I will finish and then I will show you. Okay. See like this, I have filled the colors. So I have filled these three blocks with watercolor. So I will tell you how I have used. Here I am using red color. Just like this. Taking little water. Okay, again some water and now I am mixing it with green. Okay, so here down I am using green and mixing like that. Okay, see. Just like that, here orange and yellow. Here I have used marker, so that's why my black color is not merging because I have used the permanent marker for this. So you can also make your pattern or like this. Okay, I'm done with this. I am just filling this uh, some of the circles with sketch pen, like this. All the curve shapes. I'm making some circles in that okay and after that I am just taking water on a brush and then just doing like this see sketch pen color is coming out and it is giving you a beautiful watercolor effect Same like this, I have done this also. In that, I am drawing some lines with sketch pen, like this, filling it with a sketch pen. So, my pattern is ready. Now, again, I am taking water and just mixing this sketch pen colors see this square also I am going to color with sketch pen like this also I have filled it with the sketch pen now I am using again and giving the watercolor effect so I am just taking water on the brush and just merging the color. Sorry. I am just taking water and merging the color. See? I am done with my coloring part. See? Now I am making border for this. And after that I will tell you how if you do some mistake how you can correct your artwork for example here see it is coming so I will tell you how you can rectify that so just I am making the border the color is come so just take a water just a water and merge your color and after that you can wipe it with the tissue paper 
so in, in this way you can rectify if color is coming out like this so here i'm done with my artwork so i have highlighted some squares also like this 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 you can also highlight some square if you wish to draw in this artwork i have used pencil color here some uh, crayons color here 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 watercolor here and um, sketch colors here in this 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 also so now it's your turn make it your artwork with different type of pattern and color it beautifully thank you so much have a good day bye bye